welcome back to Cover That Roof. Okay, so now that we got all of our horizontal lines chalked and all the vertical lines chalked, vertical, horizontal, and all of our vertical lines chalked, now we're ready to lay the first row of tiles. So we have a few pieces already put in place. So now we wanna go back and lay the first row of tile on top of the little cross mark. And we wanna lay right here, this tile going all the way across Make sure it's straight, then we're gonna tack it in. Then we're gonna come back and set this little uh, booster piece in. Now this is a great piece of tile right here because it has a color right here that looks really nice. We made our cut. So if we use that side to show to the street side, it's not gonna look that good because of the cut. But this side's gonna look awesome because it's a factory edge and it has the color. So basically what we wanna do is, when we get the first row set, we're gonna come back and put this booster piece in like this. So as you can see, we're gonna put a booster piece like there that's gonna go in with a little piece of cement in between the mix to keep it all together. Okay. So let's get the rest of the first row laid. Okay, now that we got the first row laid across, let's take a closer look and see how straight the row is. Wow, that looks really good. That looks pretty, pretty straight. Pretty straight. Looks like there's one tile on the fifth tile. Let's see if we can butt that a little bit. Okay, now our row looks perfectly straight. That's awesome. Okay, so now we got our straight row. So now we're getting ready to get it nailed off and then we're going to install our booster piece. Hey, welcome back to Cover That Roof. Okay, so now that we got our first row of tile of a Boral standard weight tile red tile installed on the first row, we got a perfect row going across, which is excellent. Now we wanna put in a nail. Now. Inside, we got two by six tongue and groove, so it's an open beam ceiling, so we really don't wanna go have the nail go through the tile, through the wood deck, and be exposed on the inside. That'd be a bad idea. So, we have a two inch nail right here that we're gonna use to nail in to the tile. Now, the thickness of the tile is half an inch, so this thickness right here, right here, is about a half inch which is great. And then we got the base paper and the torch 
which adds a little bit more distance of space, probably three eighths of an inch. And then you got a little air space in between. So we should be just fine and not have any shiners on the inside, which we don't want. Okay, so let's get back over here and get this all nailed off. Okay, so we're gonna get ready to get that first row nailed off. Let's see how we do. Okay, now that we got our row all nailed off, now we want to start using these booster pieces so we have the first row has a double row going all the way across. So we're going to get it set up, we're going to get to you in a bit, we're going to jump something else, and we'll see you in a few minutes. Welcome back to Cover That Roof. Okay, so now that we got our first row laid, got it all nailed off, which is fantastic, now we can start laying the booster piece in. So the first step that we want to do is take the booster piece and dip it in some water, get all the dust off so we know that the cement is going to stick perfectly. So let's see how we do that. So these are the booster pieces right here. So we just want to dip these. Just want to dip them in water. Then we know all the dust is off. We got those all dipped. Okay, so now that we got them dipped, we want to start setting our first row. Now, when we're setting the booster piece in, got to be careful which side you, you know, that you actually start on. If we start on the other side over here, as we lay each one, we're going to move the piece around and it's going to cause it to fall out of place. So we want to do it as we go. So we can just lift up each of these pieces so it will sit. Okay, you want to get the cement on there and then you just want to pick up, pick up the piece.
Okay, so I think you get the idea. So we just want to continue doing that all the way across. Got a couple more tiles to do, then we're going to start on the second row.